Hello everyone, it's Tilly from Tilly Journals and I am here with a plan with me for the week. I don't remember what the week is. Anyway, um, we used this kit from Paper Chick Plans. I've also got some glitter headers from Little Thought Store, Scribble Prints Co and Strawberry Lime Designs. I'll forget that by the end, which is why I'm telling you now. Um, so this is the last week of my Harry Potter month and so far it's my favourite. It's Saturday when I'm filming this and I think even after just filming this video it was my favourite and it still is. Um, so yeah. I decided to try colour blocking in this video which I've never done before but it's beautiful and yeah. I have unfortunately again lost a little bit of- well no. I forgot to press record on the camera at one point so I've missed out a bit of filming but um Oh well, it's fine. So, we're just getting the date covers down and then we're going to add the glitter headers. So, um, those yellow ones are from Shrubbery Line Designs, the red ones are from Little Thought Store and the blue ones Scribble Prints Co. Okay, now I've got all that out of the way, we can move on a little bit. I am super excited today because I got a ticket for me and um, a friend to go to the big meet um, which is a UK planner event um, which is in February and it will be my first planner meetup and I'm super excited <laughs> my cat just walked into the room and is just staring at me recording this voiceover it's pretty cute isn't he Jackie anyway so the sidebar is going to be green so Jack don't pull the carpet up Sidebar is going to be green, so we're starting off with this full box. I don't know whether you can hear him meow, <laughs> but he's trying to get my attention. So, sorry if I get distracted by the cat during this. Um, so then I pop down a glitter header and a piece of washi from the kit um, for a header. And then I used one of the full boxes, uh, full box checklists. Luckily the full box checklists in this are um, uncoloured, so it's fine. And I needed some habit trackers that were green because the ones in the kit weren't green and I end up using these two from Planner Face Shocker because um, it wouldn't be a spread of mine without any Planner Face stickers in would it? So I'm just going to pop my two habit trackers down, one for Instagram and one for no spend which I'm doing rubbish at. I put it in my to-do list as well this week because I really need to stop spending money but um, it's a Simply Gilded release on Friday and um, today the planner face and strawberry line designs advent calendar comes out oh sorry i've just um mute my computer that's my friend messaging me about the big meat um so yeah um just whiting out the rest of it and i'm using this washi from simply gilded it is the ravenclaw washi it doesn't have all of the colours in because it doesn't and I really wanted to use rose gold with this kit. I don't know why I wanted to use rose gold but I really did. So um, it was the only one with appropriate colours that was in rose gold. So as usual I am just cutting off the washi that I don't want. Um, and again this washi is nice and neutral so it works with the rest of the kit. If you heard that, that was my cat scattering out the room. Um, He's now meowing at something. He's insane. Bless him. He like, he, he genuinely, he just runs up and down the house in excitement some days for no reason um, because he wants to play. He he is an, he does go outdoors, but he doesn't like to go outdoors very much. He's, we've got two cats. Um, he's Jack and his sister Jess loves to go outside and spend most of her time outside. And so quite often when she's inside, she's like not interested in playing and he just wants to play when she's about. Um, and yeah, it's quite cute. So he is clearly in a very playful, I want attention, love me mood. So yeah. This bolt washi seems to be a tiny, tiny bit too long, which is why I've cut a tiny strip off each side, which is about, yeah. I didn't really know why, I didn't understand that one. So that is the basis of the kit pretty much down. Oh, we're going to pop some flags in. I'm going to use the big flag on that's green on the left and then to line up with my colour blocking I'm going to use a smaller flag on the right. Which actually looks quite well because it, um, you can see the whole flag. And I'm going to pull out my um, Handcrafted by Cherie date things, redating things. 
pop in the top corner and then I'm going to pop my date down, dots down. Anyway, I was talking about my cats. So we've had them for two years now. We um, had our old cat for most of my life until I was 20. She died when I was 22. Um, and yeah, that was devastating. It was a really rubbish weekend. Like three rubbish things happened in two days. It couldn't have been much worse. <laughs> um, um, uh, so yeah, we got them. That was sort of at the end of June. And my dad, because he's really rubbish at birthday presents and like planning things for other people's birthdays. But anyway, he decided to take my mum to the cattery for her birthday, which is the 2nd of July. Um, and you know, that mum was like, it's too soon, it's too soon. Velcro only just died. Yes, our cat was called Velcro. Um, but they came home with two cats. <laughs> I could have predicted they would have done. And mum said it was really hard because there were so many lovely cats and she wanted to take them all home. But the reason she went for Jack and Jess is that um, they weren't like friendly. Lots of the like younger, really adorable kittens. So they were seven months when we got them. Lots of the younger, really adorable kittens people would take because it's easier to deal with than like a really young kitten. But actually taking on a seven month cat um, is a lot harder because you have to sort of make them relearn what they've had for the last seven months. So Jack and Jess grew up on a scrapyard, we think. They can't tell you exactly where they grew up, but from what they said, that's our prediction. Um, and so they foraged food, like we had to keep everything in unopenable containers for the first year and a half. And even now we have to be careful with certain foods so that they don't um, eat everything in sight um, because they still have their foraging ways. It's quite cute in some ways, but very frustrating when they eat something you were going to eat. Um, not so much a problem for me because I'm veggie, but um, my parents, it drives a little bit mental sometimes. But yeah, oh well, it's fine. Well, not mental, but it's just, it's frustrating for them. That's what I mean. As I said in my last video, trying to stop using words with connotations such as that. Anyway, I just ripped that sticker really badly and I was like, oh, well, it's fine. And just like restuck it down. It worked quite well, to be fair. Um, so the reason this week, Monday to Thursday, are really full. And Friday, Saturday, Sunday are like blank because I'm working night. Well, I worked night shifts Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday night. And then Friday, you're obviously like post night shift and slightly trying to recover. Um, so those four days are really five days are mostly full. And then Saturday and Sunday are basically blank because I need to not have any plans and just get things done. And that's what I've done to be fair. I have um, got a couple of videos sorted sorted out some stickers <laughs> some no i've got some new pens sorry and i've sorted those out i've tried some foiling but it kind of went wrong um i'm waiting for some. so if you, ha if you have any advice on how to foil let me know down below um because i'm a bit stuck um i might ask advice and planners gone wild i've asked a new kpa but i've not had a response yet but i don't even know if my video is uploaded yet actually that being said um, so I'm just shifting everything up because it wouldn't be a plan with me of mine without me like ripping up at least five stickers. YOLO! <laughs> it's fine. It's all fine. Um, then what are we going to do next? Um, what else was I saying? Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I'm just trying to get some stuff done. So I've got some new pens today. I've sorted through those. I've tidied my room, which took forever. I really want to like sort out my craft st stuff and sort of like get it all organized because I can't find anything at the moment and it's really annoying me <laughs> and I really need to do my D stash but I want to sort out all my craft stuff first um, and I actually kind of want my Simply Gilded pre-order to arrive because I bought some washi to D stash for like people that couldn't get it in the pre-sale so I'm going to offer my friend Jenna it first um, and Beth and Jess 
and Maya. That's it really. <laughs> and after that, I will offer it to general people for sale. Um, I suspect they will take me up on a reasonable chunk of it. Um, but yeah. I'm just carrying on popping my plans down. So mostly my plans Monday to Thursday are sleep, work. That's it. Because <laughs> our night shifts are 13 hours, which is a really, really long time. Once you've factored in the commute to work, commute home, eating some dinner, getting ready for work and stuff, that is your whole day. Um, which is not not the most fun thing ever. The nice thing about night shifts though is that you can, um, I can, well at least I, I am um, sleep and get up and eat with my family, dinner with my family. So this is where we lose, yeah, I lost my setting up of the weekend banner but I'm showing you it there. Um, and again I colour blocked it and I used some different washi tapes. Um, so now I'm just looking for a sticker for this to-do list and then we will get everything filled out you know I don't do before the pen unless I have to um, I'm still looking for a sticker that's my these are my planner face albums by the way watch out for a video coming next week um, showing you how I've set up my planner face albums yeah. mm -hmm. so I got my um, first order from the planner boss collective for sale shockingly it was a planner face order that's what reminded me planner face sticker albums I got premium mat and she still shipped it within a week like come on Anna that is some speedy work and I love premium mat I am literally in love with premium mat right now I'm gonna buy all my future kids in premium mat removable is great because I pull everything up but just the print quality of premium mat you just can't beat it in my opinion at least um so yeah that's fine um so I'm just finishing writing everything in and I remember there is the Simply Gilded sale and I'll stick something down for that. So this week mostly I am um, working night shifts and then Friday is my brother's girlfriend's birthday and then I have a to-do list because I'll try and get lots, well I got lots done yesterday um, but it'll also sort of be a lazy day. And then the weekend of doing nothing, <laughs> except um, the Simply Gilded sale. And then today I actually bought the Big Meat tickets and I'm going to buy my Planner Face. Well no, I might like my Planner Face thing to Monday because as ridiculous as it sounds as I'm already super over budget in, August, in September for um, my Planner stuff. So I'm kind of tempted to wait till October and it go into my October budget but then I'll have less in my October budget. Mm. Such problems, but to be fair, it was the Simply Gilded pre-sale and there was a biggish release today, yesterday, today, yesterday. So that is it and I will hand over to Future Me with the finished spread. See you soon. Okay, so here we have the spread all filled out. Give you a little bit of boy go. Oh, I've got my little kitty clip that my friend got me. Still on. Um, so yeah, I really like this. I um, used lots of four boxes this week. I never use this many four boxes. Don't really know what was going on. Again, I've been I've been better at filling in my sidebar. I've marked a couple of my my habit trackers, but still not fab. Um, let's zoom in and show you where things are from. a little zoomy, um, a little focus. So, all of this except the date dots themselves are from Handcrafted by Cherie. The date dots are from Ginger Cat Co. This little star is from, um, oh what's the shop called? Diamond Print Designs. This to-do sticker is from the Happy Planner. The yellow glitter headers are from Strawberry Line Designs. The blue ones are from Scribble Prints Co. The pink ones are from Little Thoughts Store. 
Um, the Night Shift stickers are from Handcraft Grocery, as are these Nerf Send and Instagram forward stickers. This um, bed is from Ginger Cat Co. This GBBO sticker is from Your Order Colour. This um, is also from Handcraft Advisory. Um, the Habit Trackers themselves are from Planner Face. This Stripper Washi is from Simply Gilded. On the other side, we have washi from Creativity and Ink. And the other washies are from. This one is from. It's Scotch Band. This one's um, Tiger Brand. It's got hearts on. It is from Hobbycraft. And the other two I've got in these stashes. This um, cake sticker is from Ginger Cat Co. I got big meat tickets. Oh my god, I was so excited. Except I then found out that I'm potentially I'm meant to be working that day, so now I well, I might have to be working that day. So I now need to find a swap like now. <laughs> but it's February, so I've got some time. Um, and also the Strawberry Line Sun and Planner Face album. Advent Advent album. Ooh. Advent calendar-ish. It's got 12 days and um, it's been started being released and it is being released until next Saturday at 6pm British summer time. No, it's still on British summer time, right? Yeah. Anyway, UK time. Um, anyway, this sleep is from Harriet Wright Designs, the night shift is from Handcrafted by Sheree, um, the cat is from Ginger Cat Co. This sticker is from um, Fox and Cactus. The Me Time is a Happy Planner sticker. The heart is Harry Wright Designs. The arrows are handcrafted by Cherie. This is Notes and Clips, who is currently closed because she's having a baby. This is Once More with Love. Oh, I'm so excited, I got a ticket. Um, I'm going with my friend. And I'm going to be sitting, I think, with Anna from Planner who are, I'm so excited. Um, and Beth from Strawberry Design Designs. I'm literally going to be like trying not to fat girl. I love it. <laughs> and then this book um, is from Harry Wright Designs. So yeah, that is my whole week. Got to zoom back in again. Yep, try to zoom in every time. So yeah, that is my whole week filled out. It's been a good week. It's been a busy week at work. Four night shifts takes it out of you. But then had a bit of a me day after my nap on Friday, feeling very, very tired. Got lots done today, got my big meat tickets, and it's currently two in the morning on Sunday morning. Um, so we've got a bit of a list to do tomorrow, but I'm working on some of it now. That's This is one of the plan with me. Um, so yeah, one last bit of wiggle before I go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. This is the last of my Harry Potter kits. So next week we are into October and I will be using a planner face kit and gosh I'm glad to be back using a planner face kit and like knowing where things are and having everything that I want um so yeah watch out for my um October haul which is going up on Friday um yeah so thanks so much for watching comment like down below if you enjoyed this video if not let me know why and let me know whether you've ever been to a planner meetup and which one if you have um and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!